Hey guys, welcome to X Hit. Today I'm going to be taking you through the Santa Claus workout. So everything that Santa does every year to deliver all those presents, how does he do it? Well, we're going to show you today. First of all, we're going to show you how he carries those presents around. So you're going to need a duffel bag with some sand. We've got about 50 pounds in there. And you're going to rope too. And if you're feeling festive, some tinsel. So I need you to take the bag to one side. You need about 15 yards. Taking the string over your head and bringing the rope over your shoulders, we're just going to walk with our Santa snack. So keep it going as you get to the end. Step back over the bag and using your arms, pulling it back. I'm going to take it back to the other side. So twisting that bag over, back over your shoulders and pulling that sack. And one more time back over, using those arms, pulling it back. Okay, next exercise, I'm going to show you how to use that chest. So, watch your rope. I want you to step forward, pull the bag and bring it in. So just a small step. So just using your chest muscles. And Santa has to go all the way around the world. So he tends to mix up his exercises, keep it exciting. Okay, then I want you to step over on the bag and we're gonna pull it, row it towards us. So step back, pull it in. Well, I don't know how he manages to do this to all the houses, but we're gonna try and do at least half of them. Okay, step over the bag, we're gonna do it one more time. So step forward, pull the bag towards you. So really using this chest to move the bag. Okay, and one more time back. Whew, you must be pretty strong. Pull that bag towards you. That's it, give me one more. Big tug at the end. Now we're going to work on that Santa belly. So ab work time, four exercises. Come down on the floor, legs up, and we're just going to do toe touches. Opposite arm with opposite foot. We're going to do 20. So you're going to get 10 on each side. That's it, really squeeze those ab muscles. And you're halfway. Now just think. Santa's got to get up and down that chimney, so even though he's got a bit of a belly, he's still got to manage to get up and down. And all those mince pies that he eats, we've got to burn those off too. One more. Okay, we're going to go to ins and outs. So, pushing in and out to the side. 20 again. So you've got 10 each. Sit nice, slow and controlled. Squeezing those abs every time. This is a great workout that you can do over Christmas, get all your family involved and burn off those mince pies and turkey. And give me one more of each. Okay, your next exercise, bicycles. Again, 20. So one, two. Extend those legs out and really twist those ab muscles so you can work those obliques. Keep it going. Two more. Okay, your last ab exercise are leg lifts. So really using those obliques, think about engaging that tummy and they're also gonna be working those glutes too. So just lifting your leg up and down. We're gonna do 10 on each side. Let's start with the right leg. Okay, you've done five. Nice and controlled, really. Think about those ab muscles, what you're doing. And give me one more, 
and let's switch on to the other side, lifting up that left leg. As you get to the top, squeeze the glutes and feel that tummy working. Halfway. Keep it going, guys. Squeeze the glutes and give me one more. There you have it. Your chimney belly is ready to go. We've worked out our abs so we can get down the chimney. Now we've got to work out the top body so we can get out again. We're going to pick up those weights. We're going to do a one arm row. So bending nice and low, get that back flat and just extend up, bringing it in and down. We're going to do 10 of these. We've done two. Okay, get nice and slowly. Keep it going, you're halfway. Three to go. And two. And give me one more, make it count. Excellent. Okay, you can put those weights down. We can do something called the big 30. So we're gonna do out for 10, lateral, and then in front of us, and then we're gonna do a reverse fly. So 10 of each. So let's start with those laterals. If you want to, you can use a weight. But after all these exercises we've been doing in this routine, I think we can give our arms a little bit of a break. You can feel it. Give me two more. And let's bring it out to the front. And if you really squeeze those arms, you can feel the tension. So let's do it nice and slowly. Excellent job. Five. Four, three, two, one. Let's take it into that reverse fly, so get nice and low and bring it out. 10 of these. Has it really tight in your arm muscles? You can really feel it. You don't necessarily have to have weights. Three, two, and last one, squeeze it and down. Okay, pick up those weights again. We're gonna do hammers in and out. And we're gonna do 12, so you're gonna get six on each side. So we're gonna go forward, and then we're gonna take it out to the side. So that's two. Try and keep those elbows nice and still, and that core tight. Okay, you're halfway. Just got six more. Excellent job, guys. Okay, one more of each. Up to the front and then out to the side. Okay, drop those weights. I'm going to go to a 10, so it's a slightly heavier weight for our tricep extension. I need to hold the weight like this. I'm going to put it over our head. Just think about just holding the top of the weight and then we're gonna extend our arms up and it's gonna drop down. So both arms up and down. So we're gonna do 10 of these. Again, keep that stomach and core nice and tight. And really focus on using those tricep muscles. We wanna push ourselves back out the chimney. Halfway there. Keep going, guys. Give me two more. Nice and slow and controlled. Last one. And you've completed it. Put the weights down. Give your arms a shake. You're ready for Christmas. If Santa needs to call you up, you're there and ready to go. And if you want to burn off all that turkey and mince pies that you've had, this is the workout to do. Get all your friends and family involved. You can subscribe to X Hit. it is free. My name's Rebecca, if you've got any questions, just leave me a comment and I'll get back to you. And make sure you visit us again soon.